something which was introduced in Mungano that didn't give uh, that didn't put a step and this is Mungano Development Fund. This Mungano Development Fund was a very good strategy for the Mungano members to do the sustainable, uh, their sustainability in terms of business livelihood. It was a, a meeting held in India and they come, came out with the livelihood. And this livelihood, it was for Mungano or members to contribute to us that livelihood and then they get, they get the loans. But uh, uh, in fact, uh, as, uh, since whatever goes with money, people, do, people, people put a lot of interest. And uh, a lot of interest with a lot of uh, uh, internal uh, ambitions. Because... Uh, he will uh, say, I want, to, I, want to, I, want to, I want to save so that uh, I buy a plot, while me, I want to buy a car. We have so many different ambitions. While the, the other person says, I need, if, some, if this money reaches somewhere, then I collect my, the signatories, we go and dash with the money. That is also another strategy. So people, when all this were, was started, it was started uh, with in different uh, in different uh, different zones. That is the counties or the regions before, as they were called. But you find that when it, they were started, uh, some people were having some uh, different uh, 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 capacity of thinking on this. They were not thinking about uh, the development of Mungano. We are far from two, two, 1996 up to that moment. They really, uh, they, 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 they really kept that, that, thing, that one in the drawer so that they put the money at the forehead. When they were talking about this money, everybody did not, even the savings that were being done in the saving groups, nobody was doing the saving. Even if you call people to do something, people were not responding. And that is whereby we got uh, to lose the direction, a bit of the direction of the Mungano. Because people were taking money and they were not uh, giving back the money. According to the process, the process was that you, you, you take the loan and you repay. In the long run, we had some cases whereby the loans were located to people who are uh, the big loans as uh, livelihood loans. But these people took the advantage of using the big loans to disappear without giving them to members. We, all, we had also that kind of problem because when people heard that, okay, Mungano is giving people money, uh, at a lower, a cheapest interest so far than any, any microfinance or any, any, any bank can give. People came from uh, various areas, not slum areas, pretending that they are slum members, the slum areas, area members. So those who were recruiting uh, had, uh, had to, to at least to, to, to engage even an unwanted people. So all this made Mungano to, to, to lose value. Because we were dealing with people living in slum areas, it happened that so, so many people were from our other areas that are not in slums, and they, dis, uh, they disrupted Mungano. Because with us, we were used to taking a loan of 10, 20,000. While somebody is telling you, that is not money. I need 1 million, I need 500,000. So he, could, he or she could get, put some, a very big amount there in order to get that. After getting that, because the corrupt people, were, they, there was corruption within those who were, who were giving the loans uh, as members of the Federation Committee members that were working in various, various county levels. So they had to give all these loans uh, when they favor that kind of friendship or they want to to disappear with the money in another way altogether. So the money disappeared and everybody disappeared 
those who are those who are having good faith in Mungano said Mungano are thieves. Those who came new member said Mungano are thieves. That was the biggest challenge that we had in uh, in Mungano. Another challenge that uh, we are facing in Mungano, and we are on the on the on, on the solution process, that uh, we had been. Uh, uh, having Mungano projects, and these uh, Mungano projects, they have, a, they we, we put a lot of money on them, but uh, the way uh, members of the federation change the motive, because when we start the project, when we are starting the project, we start it at the at the at the, at the machinani ground. That is the the grassroots level whereby we go to the members of the grassroots level, those who are staying there. But bit by bit, within a period of some months, things do change. Those, those that are streamlining all the committee that are guiding people there, you find that one or two people are having different ideas and they convince one another so that they recruit people who are not from that slum area and then they invade. Those, those ones, those are, who are not coming from those areas, they try to invade the project so that they overpower, since they have money, they tend to overpower the others so that the, the, the project now changes the motive of the federation. So when it comes to, 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 to some kind of meetings or to, the, to resolve the problems, it becomes a bit difficult and uh, people do disagree. We have the Mukuru project, whereby Saisol, a place called Saisol within Mukuru area, Saisol is a settlement, whereby Mugano invested to buy a land for those people who are staying in Mukuru. By the time we were starting this, they were partially from Mukuru, Saisol. Even out of Saisol, no. They were from Saiso, and I was the, one of the people who enumerated that, those people, who, who the group that started there, I knew them how they started. But later on, after knowing that this land is a prime land, and Mungano has just bought it, they tried to put Mungano aside to own this land by themselves. They, they tried to get... Uh, people from other areas. Some people were coming even out of Nairobi, coming, driving, bringing money, so that they complete the, 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 the loan of the loan that they were given by the, 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 the Federation. After completing this loan, they claimed that the land is theirs, they have the right to do anything. So they had changed the motive of the Federation. Mungano is a process whereby you do the process step by step until you get whatever you need. And when you are getting whatever you need, you are getting it to the, the last percentage that is 100%. You cannot get it a half. But if you incomplete it with some other things, then it becomes a chaotic problem. And that is why we are having that chaotic problem in Mukuru. Sometimes they, they fight one another, sometimes they do so many things. They had even conned so many people as per that land. They have the documents, some documents that can prove that the land is there. Then they show you, you give the money, they buy the car, you go away. That is the, that is the business. So is that what we call the Mungan? <laughs>